What is going on, everybody? Back on at One Piece episode 317. Oh, 316. I think I'm supposed to be skipping 317 through 319. I don't know. I'll get some clarification on that. The last two episodes have been great. I really shitted on One Piece for like episodes 310, 11, 12. Um, but uh, 314 and 315 were pretty top notch episodes from just content and animation. Just great job. So I'm curious what we got going here. Um, I know we're waiting for a ship, so I mean, we're pretty much not going to leave until we get our hands on some type of ship. But we'll see what happens with that. We left off with uh, Okiji showing up, have a conversation with Nico Robin. That was pretty great. Um, and we'll just see what the story has to offer right now. I don't I don't know where we're, we're going direction-wise. I know we need a ship, but after that, I, I have no idea, so we'll see. We shall see. Oh, they party. Uh, you better get your asses up there. Carry his ass. Oh man, he's trying to get there. I wouldn't really say it's Polly's party. Oh my god. <laughs> Why is everybody so obsessed with uh, Nami? Oh yeah, they think. Oh, okay, okay, okay. But not even that. Like, there's a lot of men here <laughs> obsessed with Nami. Bro, get your ass up and go. Carry him if you have to. That looks dangerous. Uh, I'm still waiting for the use up. Um, what what his story is gonna be? I mean, I know I know his story is gonna be with us, but as far as like, does he just get on the sh new ship with us and we don't talk about? what did didn't happen type thing or maybe it's under what's understood doesn't have to be explained so who knows dang so we went to just our group to Frankie's members and the galley company to the whole towns here I mean candy or something what are you doing here buddy Oh shit. Don't smoke around the kids, man. Secondhand smoke. Jesus, Soro. That alcohol will kill you. <laughs> Imagine the government showing up and the Marines and shutting this shit down. We're in search of Luffy, Monkey D. That's it. Did those guys end up making it up there or what? Did those ships look like burnt out? Like cannon. Uh oh. Oh shit, let me skip the title. Yada yada yada. Ba 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 ba. Uh huh uh huh uh huh uh huh. Keep it going, keep it going. What the hell just happened? Five Elder Stars. Oh shit. Shanks and Whitebeard are about to make contact. Edward Teach. Excuse me, Edward Newton. Edward Teach is Blackbeard. Very, very interesting. So the, the new world is part of the Grand Line that's unconquered, unclaimed. I'm sorry, were there, was there three parts to it? Was it the part that like pretty much is marine territory, four emperor, whatever that the pirates are called territory, and then the new world? Because Kobe was talking about it. 
um, last episode. But I'm pretty sure it's not controlled by anybody, is it? And this is what I, this is what I was talking about. Didn't Shank send somebody to Whitebeard, like asking for uh, an audience? So Whitebeard seems to be not in his current prime. I mean, it's hooked up. I mean, it's hooked up to an EK EKG machine and. And a br he's got a breathing tube and shit. Why is, uh... That doesn't seem like they're catching him at his best. Or maybe it has something to do with his devils. For, I don't know. I don't know. So two of the four strongest pirates in the world right now are about to meet up. Interesting. Oh, is that Whitebeards with the big-ass whale face on it? I mean, I've been saying that they should meet up and start... I mean, you guys would be stronger together. Uh. Um. Why is everybody just passing out? Is this an ability or something I don't know about? What are we fangirling around him? Our, our subconscious mind just faints? Jeez. I mean, Whitebeard doesn't look at his best, though. Do you see what my man's hooked up to? Y'all need to team up anyway. You'll be stronger together. Why not group together, take out the navy, and then distribute things after the fact? There to discuss. This is a great episode to go with here. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I was thinking to myself, how can they up themselves, but... Okay. Okay. He's from West Blue. How about you drink that shit first before I just get poisoned right here, right? Do we feel safe here just leaving these two like this? Roger Garp and Sengoku, he says. An apprentice to Roger. Buggy was a part of that too. God, I hate Buggy. Who gave who gave them their scars, by the way? Because he's got the scars here. White Bear's got the scars here. And they went on to form their own crews. One's doing better than the other. From what we've seen, at least. Him and Hawkeye used to throw hands.
This is the second episode they've used these kind of like flashback slides here. I don't know how I feel about it yet. What are we here to talk about? Let's cut the bullshit here. What, what, are, what are we talking about here, guys? Okay. Are we about to have three out of three just banger episodes in a row? And it has nothing to do with fighting at all? <laughs> hey, I say, you know, we give them their shit, but their world building has been... Blackbeard. Edward Teach. Mm-hmm. Blackbeard seems to be an issue. Make his move for what to become one of the top four ones like them? Mm -hmm. so he's that big of a problem, huh? He seems to be a bit of a problem. Are we feeling threatened that he's going to topple what we. What's Ace doing? Is he on an assass is he on an assassination mission? What what's stop Ace from doing what? Eh? Nani? So Blackbeard gave him that scar. This man is on life support. Literal life support. Crime was killing one of his crewmates. I mean, I don't disagree, but are, is Shanks essentially saying that Ace is just not up to par yet? Well, this wasn't as productive as I thought it was going to be. The big ass bowl, by the way. I'd love to see Whitebeard in his prime. He got up from the uh, the devices, huh? Okay, guys, let's relax here for a second. Let's all take a deep breath. Everybody relax. Yeah, that wasn't as great as a conversation. <coughs> that strong, huh? I'm curious where, um, so that's a, you know, great display of power and shit, right? Where does an Okaji or a Son Goku fare with what we just saw? I actually honestly don't know what we just saw as far as his presence making people pass out, his Hakai or whatever we're talking about. Um... It's kind of like, spoilers, Hunter Hunter, when they're at a Heaven's Arena and they can't even walk past Hisoka's aura because they just don't know. So like for me, I don't know what I just saw as far as power goes. Um, 
just have to wait to see more. I feel like if I saw a battle with Nen or Chakra or Ki going on, I would have no idea what I'm looking at. Chopper's nose is blue right there. Well, of course they did. You did. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Chopper wants a bounty so bad. Oh, I forgot the only two with a bounty right now are, um... The only two with the bounty are Luffy and Zoro. Everyone's gonna have their their bounties up soon. Ooh, both of them come together for one final ship build. That would be pretty dope. Oh. That'll be pretty dope, seeing these two come together. Oh shit! The Avengers are assembling to build us a ship. Dope. I like it. Collapse to One Piece for the last three episodes. I've been doubting, you know I have been doubting, kind of the greatness of it. But, uh, past three episodes have been good. Not enough to launch it to best of the best status, but it's been pretty good. Boom. Actually, we might have time for a little bit of something here. I was about to say, Luffy was in the room. Oh yeah, he was he was sleep eating. That's right. I hope it's big. I want a big ship, man. Everyone in their own private rooms. Girl, it's empty. Did all that and look crazy. Put it back. Ooh. Gave away the remaining money to fund the party. I was I was wondering where all that shit came from. Here's how this episode ends. It's interesting that they put this here. They could have put this in front of the shipbuilding part. I'm curious how this episode's about to end. To end here, does it just kind of end like this slice of life? Seems like an anticlimactic ending. Zoro, lo mm. it's a damn shame. <laughs> it's an interesting way to end the episode. I would have put this in front of the Frankie in them finishing the ship and ended it with that. It's not bad. I think I missed one line I wanted to see. What about... Such a rampage, maybe our... Wait, 
What's the deal when the Frankie family went on such a rampage? He said your grandpa spun it. I don't know. Somebody, if they had no life on the run, from, if they had to live right from the life on the run, I'd feel bad. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. I don't know if that has anything to do with anything other than explaining why they're not in trouble. Um, this here though, we had some pretty uh, dope shots here. I'm trying to see the good one that we had. There's a pretty good shot of them exchanging blows. We see Whitebeard's crew here. Ace, which we knew. I want to see how good was the shot of... Uh... It's still too soon to have those two fight. What does he mean by that? Meaning Ace isn't ready? He said Ace is strong, I know that much. It's still too soon to have those two fight. He Like, he, like, like Ace just can't. that fame and trust to make their math complicated. Mm. I want to see when they... Ooh, that's a pretty dope shot. I feel like we had better though. When he was like walking up there initially, I feel like we had some pretty good uh, shots. I'm trying to look for one good shot here. So they both have got have fought Blackbeard. Is what you're is what you're telling me. Is what I'm assuming here. I think that's the shot though. Two of them staring at each other. I wonder if at this point in the story was the power system thought of or a thing. Oh, always curious with that. Um, regardless. I was curious what his meeting was going to be for. Is this also a... Because I don't know how much time has passed between... Because didn't... Uh, Shanks send a messenger to Whitebeard... Asking to meet bef even before the Ennis lobby? I think even before we went to Skypea. Um, I asked that to say, like, is that is that what this is... What he was referring to? So it seems... Blackbeard... Edward Teach... Edward Newton, Edward Teach, um, used to be a crew member of Whitebeard's. He has since been excommunicadoed um, for killing one of his crewmates. Now, is there going to be a sad story behind that as to why he did that and he's just wrongfully accused? Or is he just a piece of shit? <laughs> TBD. The people a Blackbeard has with him, his sniper and his buddies. Are they also people that have defected from Whitebeard's crew, or did he find them along the way? We'll find out. Um, it seems, though, Blackbeard was strong enough to give Shanks a scar. And I think Whitebeard said the same thing. You know, we have a scar from the same person, so I'm assuming they're both referring to Blackbeard. Regardless, the man seems to be pretty strong. And is he saying, so I'm assuming that Whitebeard's second strongest in command is Ace? Luffy's brother and he sent him to capture or to kill Blackbeard and Shanks seems to be s trying to stop that well here's the thing though why would you want to stop like what care do you have for Ace now if he knows Luffy maybe he has a decent relationship with Ace too so maybe that's why he doesn't want Ace to do it um, but if he has no connection to Ace and you think Blackbeard is an issue maybe Ace has a chance you know, kill, get him out the way um, but it seems Blackbeard's trying to build and do his own thing. We saw because didn't Blackbeard send somebody to the uh, Marines to say like, "Hey, you guys need a warlord? I got somebody." It looks like he's just trying to ascend to power. For what? I don't know. Um, but it's enough to make Shanks worried. Um, I could sit here and talk about power and I wonder what his devil's root ability or his power is and how does it rank to theirs. But the thing is, I don't even know what they do and how strong they are. Um, and I don't know what Blackbeard does, so to, to try to sit here and say, is he currently as strong as them? Is he going to be? Is he already? Is it not even close? Could it be a competition? Plus, there's still two other pirate um, 
kings walking around and I don't know the relationship between these two and those two and yada yada yada. You've already heard my, they should put the egos aside, come together, wipe out the marines and then deal with everything accordingly, but they're too prideful to do so. So, especially Whitebeard, he seems like he would rather fall than come together. We'll see how that goes though, but... Hats off to uh, One Piece. The last three episodes have been bangers. Absolute bangers. And it's really restored my faith because I lost a little bit of faith the way the uh, Ennis Lobby arc ended. <laughs> so great stuff. Keep it up. See how it goes. Appreciate it, everybody. Like, share, and subscribe as always.